Hi everyone, uh, Django here. I have a special little treat for you guys. I hope uh, Obi-Wan doesn't mind me making this video, but I actually had some uh, great progress in this hill today, so I and was very pleased with it, so I'm documenting it, and I'm sure he'll hopefully uh, make his own review up, because they turned out much better than I thought they were going to. Anyway, this is a Darth Maul. It's is a Master Replicas version, the FX version, and it has two crystal focuses in it, one in each end. Da -da -da -da. They're right about here. Uh, the power supply is nickel metal hydride, and uh, there are Luxian 3 red for the uh, main LED. Uh, when he initially contacted me about it, he wanted some sound font changes, which is easy enough to do on 3.0, especially if you can access the uh, sound card. Um, and he wanted a lithium ion power supply and the blade holders board out. Well, unfortunately, once I uh, actually got into the Saber, um, the original builder it looked like he epoxied the entire thing. Um, <laughs> I really couldn't get in there to get the full thing done. Uh, I made Obi Wan some custom blades that are uh, quite. Um, Round it down. They look like Ultra Effects blades, honestly. And I uh, changed the sound fonts, and um, I actually did get the bottom part of the saber apart. But I had to um, resolder lines once I got it set up properly. Originally, when it came to me, the uh, sound was way, way, way too loud. Like it, it was super distorting the speakers so loud, and it, you couldn't hardly use it. Well, anyway, let's uh, go ahead and get into the fun a little bit. The sound cards in it are identical. Each one has the same fonts on it, the same settings, everything. I did increase uh, the sensitivity settings because Obi-Wan said it, it didn't register any swings when he was swinging around. And once I initially got it all back together, I noticed the same thing. The sensitivity is set at n like 95%, the highest it can go. It, it's a point, excuse me, 0 0.9 on the uh, eye setting. Alrighty, let's go ahead. These are the kill keys that came with it. I didn't do anything to it. And as you can tell, the Saber is still pretty loud. Um, it does not have any blinkies on it, on either Saber. Uh, it does have inhale recharge, obviously. Okay, the main power switches are the red button. I'm going to go ahead and just do one right now. Now for the other one, this is a Mad Cow's Mall font. Okay, it'll be way too loud for me to go into both the menus, so I'm just going to go into to one menu to show to show the, the sound fonts. Okay, and you have to double tap to go into the menu. That's uh, Qui-Gon's uh, funeral for the uh, menu background, in case anybody's wondering. Kind of seemed to fit. Mad Cow's Corbon. Okay, we're going to stick with Maul because the other one's on Maul and it would be a little bit... Odd to have them. And that has some of Avatar's boot sounds on it. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and um, put two the blades in. So you guys can see what they look like all lit up. The 
this is a pretty beastly saber. The blades are um, a custom length. He, he wanted them 35 inches. Well, the, with the tip and everything, he wanted a pointed tip. They ended up being, you know, about 36 inches total. Out of the hilt, there you lose about two inches. So maybe 33, roughly. Yeah, I don't know. They told me there would be no math. Those LEDs are getting 1.5 amps, by the way. Pretty neat, huh? Okay, this will also separate. And they function independently of each other. <laughs> quite a fun little set I hope he enjoys them I mean I was really kind of bummed that I couldn't get them apart when I initially uh, got into it and then I finally twisted it around a little bit and took the recharge ports out and finagled a way to get them out to uh, turn down the sound and uh, they're a lot of it's a lot more comfortable. The, the original owner had them overdriven on the, the, the pots. It made it really loud. And it was so distorted. But anyway, um, you know, you can even do it. Just take one blade out and have a tattooing version if you need some leverage. You could stick a blade plug in one end and still have both sounds going. Uh, it's a pretty sweet little duo. I hope you uh, enjoy this, Obi Wan. I mean, kind of makes me want to build one. <laughs>